Excitement enveloping everyone here because it is a huge occasion. The Champions League final. Who's going to be crowned club kings of Europe? It's Borussia Dortmund. They take on Real Madrid and it's coming up next on EA TV. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. It is Borussia Dortmund taking on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. Borussia Dortmund have given it away. And here's the 11 for Borussia Dortmund. Emre Can starts alongside Marcel Zabitza in the centre of midfield. And Niklas Füllkrug is up front. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Ferlon Mendy plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And the story in attack is one. Oh, in with a chance! He's done it! What a moment! The opening goal in this Champions League final. And just look at the celebrations. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And once he gets onto it, there's only going to be one outcome. It's a lovely goal. Well, the action underway. Can Real find a response now? Marlin. And angling it back. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Mendy. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Rodrigo. Well, that's good defending. Well organised at the back. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Oh, surely! Well, whatever way you slice it, a long, long way from the target, Stuart. Well, a lack of technique and composure there. That's a bad miss. A very effective challenge put in. Chouameni. This is Kroos. Rodrigo. Well read to put an end to that attack. And support available. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. So deflection, and it will be a throw in. Well, Dortmund's have it once again. He's in with a chance. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him.
Really bright looking attack. Oh, an incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. Chouameni. Mendy has it. Jude Bellingham. Valverde. And return to Rodrigo. Daniel Malin. Well, a bit of an unforced error, and it's going to be a throw. Another perfect position to read it. Cross, it looks promising. Nacho Fernandez. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. Well, the danger was on, but just a fraction offside. Marlin. Real chance. A goal! He's dispatched it, much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, it's a decent goal, but the defenders certainly played their part. Where were they? They were absolutely all over the place. blistering first half display and just look at that score Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick Carvajal likes to run with the ball at his feet well, didn't go to plan in the end. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. And in with a real chance. And in range. And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, when things are going wrong, it's always the manager that's under fire. Ancelotti needs to make some big calls here. Nacho Fernandez. Mendy has it. And he's won the ball. Promising sequence. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Out of play, Real Madrid throw here. Well, no let up, plenty of pressure. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. And drawing it back. Well, hit with power, but shame about the placement. They know they need to stop him. And with that, the first half comes to an end here at Wembley Stadium.
So back in business, Borussia Dortmund very much bossing it in the first 45 here. Let's see how the second half pans out. Hummers. Krug. Oh, fancy footwork. Must be. Oh, he wasn't necessarily favourite to win that challenge. And they need to get tighter here. Not a very good challenge, and he skips past his man. And we're focusing on him for a reason, Stuart. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders. Well, he's been at his best today. He just seems to get his shots away so easily. And he's taken his goals really well. Brilliant stuff from him. Vinicius Jr. And back to Mendy. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Seemed to just lose control of the situation. He's conceded a corner. And fired over by Kroos. Dortmund have been awarded the free kick by the referee. Nico Schlotterbeck and intercepted it. Jude Bellingham. Phil Krug. Zabitza. And nothing comes of that attack. Aurelien Chouameni. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Oh, did well to skip through. Surely! Well, given the position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Superb opportunity squandered. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Jaden Sancho. Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. Ozelu. Well, a good tackle. Federico Valverde. And Bellingham. Can he put it away? And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. And a short corner, let's see. And delivered into the box. Appeared to be in two minds. Well, they can bring it out now. This might be ideal for the counter. And defending as a unit. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. And fired from the flank into the area. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. 
Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Brandt. Can he take advantage? And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing. Just can't stop him today. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Went in strongly to win the ball. Plenty of support here. So a throw in for Real Madrid. Well, this game almost in the books and a story of Dortmund excelling, Stuart. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Real Madrid have given it away. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Sancho, opportunity here. Oh dear, not a great effort, was it? Substitution it is for Dortmund. We're inside the final five minutes. My goodness, this has not been close at all. Brandt. Oh, great attacking play. And did just enough defensively. Substitution for Real Madrid. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? On a corner like that, every goalkeeper's dream, really. Vinicius Junior. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Phil Krug. Well, three minutes of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Well, a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Take it away. Vinicius Junior. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. Schlotterbeck Rami Ben Sabaini Here's Phil Krug How about this? Borussia Dortmund have only gone and won the UEFA Champions League well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation 
of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Borussia Dortmund. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. And that's exactly what they're doing. Trotting over towards their supporters to say thank you. A collective effort always on these occasions. Well, what more can you say? They are the best team in Europe. And it wouldn't be a big final without photograph time. Yeah, and these photographs will be cherished for years to come. Really top-class scenes here.